Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Mr. Tech Buddy, helping you go smarter and faster with technology. So, in this video, I'm gonna do S7 Edge Nougat update review. So, let's begin. So, guys, finally, Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge, the award winning phone, finally get the Android Nougat update. and. I updated the Nougat a few hours before and it's really great experience for me using this Nougat update on my S7 Edge, especially uh, the blue light filter on evening. It's really, it's really phenomenal and so let me quickly uh, show you the, the major changes that are made inside my S7 Edge after the Nougat update. So the first one is the notification by itself. So you can see now if I scroll down it gives cleaner look cleaner and elegant look of the notifications you can see the notification bar is now cleaner with without the down arrow button here if you uh, drag down a little more it will give you the whole notification panel uh, as you can see as you can see the changes how now the, the design is really cleaner look as you can see that They've added a performance mode and also blue light filter mode. The blue light filter is same as the iOS uh, night mode. Okay, it will uh, emit the blue light and will give you the better <coughs> experience on, on, especially on evening. So let me quickly uh, on the blue light filter and show you the uh, changes. As you can see, uh, now it has it it emitted the blue light and with the cleaner look and feel so let me quickly switch off that and continue it so the the other major update are the performance mode so let me show you that once 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 we click that performance mode it will give four different performance modes to choose choose from the first one is optimized which is the recommended mode okay and the second one is the game mode and the third one is entertainment the game mode is especially uh, for enhancing your game experience by making games run more smoothly and the entertainment uh, mode is enjoying music and videos with ultra high quality sound and enhanced images which is really cool I've tried all these different modes and the experience is truly immensely great and the high performance mode when you, when you set the high performance mode you S7 will do magic guys I, I will experience it and it's really great experience for me and please do go comment below how was experience and those who didn't get the nougat update yet please do not worry you will be getting the update in coming days because the nougat update is now officially rolling out by samsung itself okay so let me quickly go to the other changes and show you it quickly so now the settings area they have made it really cleaner and they grouped all things very uh, cleanly to give us the best user interface so as you can see inside the connection let me show you what what you got here so inside the connection we have Wi-Fi a Bluetooth phone visibility and all those that have been presented on the previous marshmallow itself with they have made uh, an extra area here as you can see here they're looking for something area uh, which will give in the quick support if you do, if you miss out something you can really uh, use this area to get the quick support from Samsung itself okay and sounds and vibration here they have made some changes and they, they have grouped it perfectly as you can see here with the line the ringtone all those things are they have presented on the previous marshmallow itself with that looking for something else you can if you if you want to use this just by clicking here it will go to that particular thing or task okay now now the cooler part is the notification uh, settings they have they have made the notification block and allow notification uh, settings more easier for us to choose from so if you if you, if you wish to uh, not if you wish to uh, if you wish 
uh, not to have a notification for a particular app you can easily easily come here and just click here and we can uh, on or off the particular app notification okay. if I off this it's not gonna uh, give the notification from this particular app it's really uh, simple and cleaner now so let me show you the display area so the display area we have seen the blue light filter we can also schedule the blue light filter according to our wish okay uh, i just set to custom schedule i just uh, the starting time i set is 9 you can change it from here if you want it from 7 uh, 7 am it's uh, 7 pm itself you can set it here just really quickly so that's how simple it is and now just turning off now for the sake of this review so all this uh, screen mode was uh, already present on the marshmallow itself and they have they have also uh, changed the uh, always on display also okay and the status bar, bar has now like the previous marshmallow it, it remains the same so the, uh, the, bit, the best part that I've found is this looking for something else area this is really cool and if you, if you want to go to smart state these are the video and hand so just click here it will be heading you to the video and hand and hands remote so and other area is what we present themes which remains the same as the marshmallow and advanced features they have uh, now uh, like I mentioned they have ch changed the alignment of it and the settings remains the same inside this and the best part that I am <clears throat> enjoying is the device maintenance area uh, in this area they have made really great uh, changes inside this device maintenance which will they will be giving a score for device performance now you can see my defense performance is now excellent because the nougat update the nougat is made to be an excellent and as you can see if you want to optimize this by clicking the optimize button you can optimize it and the battery area now they have made a uh, further enhancement on power saving mode you can choose from uh, a mid power saving to the max power, power saving mode according to your device usage and you can easily easily power save more from here choose from the certain apps and just click this save power it will quickly uh, optimize the apps to give you the best battery life which is really uh, amazing uh, a future to have in for your smartphone like s7 edge and they have the storage option if you want to clean something you can just simply go here and just choose choose the from and clean it so especially the nougat update user interface is really a 10 on 10 everything is aligned so, uh, perfectly and really easy to access and the ram area so in the uh, in the previous marshmallow it was just smart manager with the ram cleaner or thing now it has improved a way better than the previous one so i'm just cleaning the ram to show you how it works you can see 640 RAM has been cleared now it's really super fast now with the Nogra update the device security which was uh, already present in the last version previous version much more itself so let me quickly uh, go to the application area so the application area remains the same as the previous you can see all uh, those things so and let me quickly uh, go to the lock screen and security so here we have uh, we have a uh, <coughs> we have one change which is Samsung Pass. They have now we can use Samsung Pass to uh, the use of Samsung Pass to access your favorite service with biometric data. So they have included the biometric data. So uh, let me read it for you guys. So protect your biometric data with prevent identity to prevent identity theft. So instead of removing complicated password, sign into website in Samsung Internet using your biometrics. So we can using uh, using biometrics. We can now using uh, multiple accounts. And it's really great features. So uh, we can set it up and use it. 
so other things re remain the same if you can see here and cloud and icons remain the same so this is the as you can see here I choose the Google it will access it will be giving uh, access to the my personal account so general management remains the same with some um, with <coughs> with a perfect uh, alignment of things and those things remain the same so uh, this is the quick uh, review and uh, l let me also show you the camera so if you if you just swipe it uh, swipe to the left it will give you the front camera and if you just swipe to the right again it is the back camera okay that's really awesome and the sending idea all remains the same so that's it guys hope you guys enjoyed this uh, review so uh, hope you guys like this video and please do comment below how was your experience with this new nugget update on s7 edge and if you didn't subscribe this channel yet please do subscribe and get further updates from mr tech buddy see you in the next video